Hey guys, welcome to your uh, prediction reading for Taurus. This is going to be for your um, October 2023. You can apply this to any of our placements because anything could come up. Uh, we are going to take a look and see um, what's coming towards you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys could expect for October. And then we'll finish off the reads to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your unique situation. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages or the collective um, Taurus people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If we're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The uh, link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok and also on Instagram, the links for those are in the description box below. I do also post readings on there too, okay? So tell me about Taurus. Taurus. What's coming towards Taurus? What's surrounding Taurus? What does need, uh, Taurus need to know? What can Taurus expect for October 2023 for Taurus? All right, Taurus, let's see what we have for you guys. All right, five of cups. Seems like you're dealing with some sort of disappointment here, some sort of grief, some sort of loss here. I feel like someone here is just really disappointed. And, and, I, and I, or feel very let down and I feel like someone here just cannot stop thinking about it. I feel like someone here is losing sleep over this. I feel like someone here is trying to figure out what to do next. I mean, this could be regarding someone that you're dealing with here or that this could be regarding maybe, you know, maybe a work situation that didn't work out. Maybe you had expectations of a work situation turning out uh, you know, you're expecting it to turn out the way that you wanted it to, but it didn't work out. And I feel like you could be in this energy of like look, looking for something new at this time. The Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy with the Five of Pentacles here and the Hangman. It seems like you're definitely going through some sort of obstacle here. Yeah, one of the things that's important is just for you, Taurus, is just to surrender and allow things to work out the way it, sh it should. If it was meant for you, it will work out. You know, if it's not, you know, obviously the universe is trying to force you out or the universe is showing you signs that you don't belong here. Some of you guys could be seeing a lot of synchronicities such as 55555, five, 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 okay? So this is about change. This is about uh, conflict here. Um, tell me about the Five of Cups, the Hangman Piscean Energy, the Five of Cups and the Nine of Swords. You guys are losing sleep. You guys are not sleeping well. The Eight of Swords here. The Eight of Swords and the Emperor here, Aries Energy. Oh, shoot. Some of you guys are really stressed and anxious and losing sleep, and I feel like some of you guys are feeling like you're losing control here. You know, with the Nine of Swords and the Five of Cups, some of you guys could be drinking yourselves to sleep because you guys can't sleep. Uh, Two of Wands and the Justice card, Libra Energy, the uh, Page of Wands, and Temperance, Sagittarius Energy. This is so interesting. Some of you guys might be dealing with a very troubled child right now, and that could be keeping you up. If you guys have children, uh, if you guys have a child, um... Uh, whoever this is, I do feel like this child tested the boundaries of the law here. And I feel like this person got in trouble. This child got in trouble here. One of the things I'm getting here is that I feel like whoever this is, this child or this younger person is, I do feel like this is an individual that will turn their life around because it's almost like the final straw here, you know? And, um, you know, and whatever this is, you know, I just feel like, you know, uh, even though if this is a child, obviously, you know, it's your child, you're worried about them. You just have to let the process work itself out. Yeah, you just have to let this ch ch person have their experience so that they can learn their lessons here. Uh, because if you hinder them, if you tell them, oh, don't do that, you know, it, you're going to hinder them from learning the lessons that they need to learn. Does that make sense? Even though it's hard for a parent, I would assume, to watch a child go down a path of 
you know, a, a path that's not so great, you know, it's hard and difficult, but you just have to allow them to have that experience in order for them to learn their lessons, you know? I mean, I'm not a parent, but, you know, I, it's just, I feel like it's important for each individual, whatever path that they're on, is to allow them to have that experience in order for them to learn, because they're meant to have, the, they're meant to have that experience for a reason. They're going down that path for a reason, you know? So we have the Four of Pentacles here and the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn towards Virgo here. Some of you guys are struggling with money here too. I mean, it could be that you're paying all these legal fees right now and, and, and maybe some of you guys are working overtime too, okay? What else do we have for, for Taurus? What else do we have here for Taurus? What else do we have here for Taurus? Tell me about Taurus here. Nine of Pentacles and a Chariot, Cancer Energy. Nine of Pentacles, Virgo energy, pre Empress energy here with the Five of Swords and the Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. You know, one of the things I'm getting is that I feel like this child went down the path of trouble when you separated from your spouse. Yeah, I feel like that's when it triggered it. I feel like one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like this child really blames themselves or something like that, or that they're acting out to get some sort of attention here, you know? Yeah, maybe this child didn't want you guys to separate, and I feel like this child didn't listen, like, you didn't, maybe they, they felt like they weren't heard, you know, but, you know, I do feel like the explanation that you gave to them at that time didn't really resonate with them at that time, but I feel like maybe now that they're older, it might, they might understand better, um... Let's see, the Lovers, Ace of Pentacles, the High Priestess, and the Three of Pentacles. You know, I, I feel like you're definitely moving towards a new, there, there's a new beginning that's happening here. You know, whatever the situation is with you and this child, I mean, it doesn't have to be a child, it could be a friend. I feel like it's going to bring your relationship closer here together. Yeah. Um, the Page of Cups. We have the Devil. Wow. Five of Swords and the Hermit Virgo energy. This is definitely going to leave some sort of mark on this child here. Um, you know, I do feel like this child might need some sort of energy work, some sort of counseling or something like that, some sort of therapy here. Uh, because I feel like um, this person's definitely, this child here is definitely holding in a lot of anger. Yeah, a lot of rage here too. The Chariot. With a page of pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, the nine of pentacles here, and the two of cups. Uh, some of you guys could be receiving a new job or or, or, or that a job offer, uh, you know, uh, and I feel like this is going to take you away. So I see that there's a move that's happening here for you, Taurus, but I feel like this new job will be very high paying here. It's going to pay you a lot. So uh, there's a lot going on here, uh, Taurus. Yeah, there's a lot going on here. I really feel strongly this reading has something to do with a parent and a child, okay? So, um, so Taurus, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.